actually. But everybody's really comfortable and happy with where their saw's at. We get to do the fun part. We get to put our belt back on. Why is there that sigh? Nobody wants to do this? I said fun part. I didn't say this is the hard part or this is the part nobody likes to do. This is the fun part. Wait for me, people. Don't start. Um, I have had so many people call me up and I'll sp speak with them for an hour, two hours, and their saw is not working. I've got everything on there. I'm turning on, nothing's working. They do not have their belt even close to right. I ask them all these questions. Is it here? Is it there? Oh, yeah, sure. They're not, I don't even think they're looking at the saw at the time. <laughs> it's not right. Look at page seven. There's the, there's the belt right there. It may be hard to see. Um, you might even want to take time with your pencil and color it in when you get a chance so you know which way it goes. Um, for God's sake, pull out page seven because this is going to be a real pain in the butt. It should be real easy. It's just the belt. It's like putting the one on here. I have trouble with this, but my belly's in the way. Okay, so we got this thing. We want to make sure it's turned so the teeth side are out. The teeth side's the bumpy side. So they're facing out. If it's facing in, you're going to have all kinds of trouble, so make sure it's out. Teeth out. Exactly opposite of why these belts were made. It's because we're Gemini saw. That's how we do things. Okay. We all got our teeth facing out? I was taught that by the president of the company. I used to do things right. I started working for them, and it's all backwards now. I wasn't even left-handed before I worked there. They just made me that way. It's weird. I had no choice. Okay, we all got teeth out? Okay, now just uh, grab a waste paste per basket and throw this away because we don't need any more. Okay, here we go. This is the pulley we're going to start with right here. Can everybody see that? Because this is real easy and you're all going to think you're experts when you do this. Make a little loop. Make a little loop like that. Hook it on that blue pulley. Give yourselves a hand when you do that because there you go. Your belt expert's right there. You know, that's beautiful. It's all that easy. Yeah. No, really. I swear. Okay, everybody got it hanging over that? Yeah. Now you, you go under the drive gear. Now you know when you do this right because your teeth are meshing with that gear, right? Under the drive gear, over this guy, over this top left hand pulley. We're going to spend time on this because I want to make sure everybody's comfortable with this. This is a pain in the butt, but let's make sure everybody's comfortable. We don't have to rotate anything yet because uh, we're not anywhere near the, uh, the blade, so we can kind of just stick it on for now. Probably going to end up coming off while we're doing this, but it's so easy to put on, we don't really care. Okay, everybody's got it there? Okay. This is where you make a decision as far as how mechanically inclined are you. Do you want to remove this pulley? That's what we're going to do first. Take your screwdriver. This is going to be pretty tight, so whoever's the stronger of the group, unscrew that pulley for us. The blue one right here. Everybody take a look. This blue pulley right here. Is it, is it too small? OK. Check this out. Mine works for something. Whoever's got their pulley off, take it in your hand. Show it to me. I was going to say throw it, but that's, well, not a good idea, but hey, I caught it. Go ahead, throw it. I can catch it. OK, we've all got our pulleys. OK, close to where this thing goes, just wrap the belt around it. Kind of hold it like this, like a bow, like you're tying your shoe. Can everybody see that? OK, set it into place, but hold it tight because you don't want it to get caught in that, belt, that blade. You'll kind of see it'll, it'll just kind of fit right where it needs to go. I've got mine on the other way. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to show everybody that. It's actually a matter of, of looks. It doesn't really matter. And then you can put it in by hand and then crank it down. Did everybody get that? Did everybody get it on? Everybody feels good about that? Because I can't get mine on. No, just tying it down. OK, I've got a blue pulley in my hand. Some of you may not have noticed. Small hole side, large hole side. Doesn't matter. It's, um, if they're all small hole side out, put all small hole side out because it looks pretty. But um, it's not going to misalign anything. That's how they go. So don't, don't worry about it if you've noticed that. Large hole, small hole. Can you see that? Go ahead and take it in your hand. You can, you can have it. Um, that's how we press those things in. So we need a large hole to get that bearing in. Doesn't matter. It's just where it's pressed. Once it's in, it's permanent. You hear that? She's got it. OK, everybody's got that on there. Are they tight? Are they pretty close? You have a little trouble? No, yeah. we're just going to take the uh, naked one out of there and get it yeah, out of the way. Get it off. Throw it in your box. Take it home with you. You got an extra one. To do. Yeah, we don't need it on there. You see what I had to go through? I went through a few years of having to deal with that naked bearing, but I had to keep it on. I'd lie awake crying at night sometimes because of that bearing. 
I think I'm lying. It's, it's a horrible dream. I'm going to take this time to take a sip of water while you guys get that. This is a plug for water. It's God's drink. Okay. Everybody got it? Okay. We're going on to the next step. When you wrap the belt around the ring, it's very important to whoever got in front of me. I hope you did it right. Keep it loose around the ring because you want to make sure that the blade is going to be centered in that little groove. You see that groove that's in there? Make sure the blade is centered in that groove. If you shove it off to the inside, you won't see it, but you're going to flip that switch and the saw is not going to move because it's not aligned. So wrap it loosely around the raceway. Now I'm going to have to pass out my screwdriver again because we're going to take off that bottom blue pulley just like we did the top. So you, you guys are loving this, aren't you? Yes. To take a, to t when you're taking it off and taking it off. I'm going to show both ways because it's easy to get it off no matter what you do. You could, I mean, if you want to, you just take everything off the saw and it, it falls out. But I want to show both ways because I, I feel when you're first looking at the saw, if you, f if you slap the belt on like I'll show you and I look really good when I do it, um, it, it saves so much time and you won't get that groan from the crowd that you just, hear, you just heard. It, it just makes your life a lot easier. It, it, it's intimidating, but it's easy. It's very easy. Who needs this? Anybody? Thank you. Okay. He asked first, so you guys are next. I now see what we're talking about. Small hole, large hole, you see? Yeah, I, yes, so that you could slide the bearing in here. Exactly. They're actually pressed in. Um, yeah. On your saw, odds are you have a different type pulley. It's a, it's a softer pulley. You can pop yeah. the grommet off of the bearing and put a new bearing in. These are permanent. Same price, though. We didn't raise the price for that. Just a better pulley, lasts a lot longer, and no troubles. Well, you know, all the parts that you buy for the two are interchangeable. So whatever you buy today will be the stuff that's on this saw. So you'll get the, you'll get the better parts either way. Did you get it? OK. OK. Just chuck it out. You got it loosely there. You want to? You see how long this is taking? Not, not, to, uh, not to beat up on you guys, but you see how long this is taking? It's kind of a tedious process, and we're not even done yet. Um, not that you'll have a bunch of people in your store doing it at the same time, but this takes a lot longer than, than the way I do it. Um, I'm going to show you it a couple times after we get this back on. I'm going to take it off, put it on, take it off, put it on. Yeah, and you guys are, um, and then you guys are going to try it. Um, it it's it's going to be worth it, believe me. OK. I think that, uh, who's got my screwdriver? Anyone? You, you never touched my screwdriver? I can see it from there. <laughs> uh, he's got my screwdriver at work. I teach. OK. All right, look at this. I'm a screwdriver catcher now. OK, same thing, but I want you guys to keep the, the uh, belt loose around the raceway. Don't wrap it around tight. Just leave it loose so there's plenty of slack. Wrap this thing like you're doing your shoelace and screw it back in. Make sure now, you see that blade there? Make sure that you don't push the blade out of your way. Keep it tight around the pulley. It's really hard to see probably. Keep it tight around the pulley like this. Set it in. There is, but it doesn't matter which way you put it on. It, it, this is going to sit right where it needs to go. If it's not sitting right where it needs to go, you didn't, you didn't get it on right. Tighten it down. Um, if you needed my screwdriver to loosen it, just use your own to tighten it because we don't care if it's tight right now. We just want to get semi-tight. We'll fix it later. Okay. How do we feel about that? If you guys need to stand up like I'm doing to work on the saw, it's a lot easier, so feel free. It's not a movie. Did you get it? You don't look happy with it. Oh, he's done. That does my heart good. Okay.